frustrations, right? I see people uh, online, comics and other folks, everybody's chomping at the bit, at the bit to get out there. And um, I appreciate that, right? Because uh, I want to get out there too. But, you know, I, I honestly, I, I don't think it's a, a great idea to be pushing that envelope just yet. And um, I've had some folks ask me, why aren't we doing more as a city? And, you know, I would say that I don't have the luxury of basing my decisions off of Facebook posts, right? When you're responsible for 50,000 people and the well-being of your community. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to make those decisions based off of um, Facebook uh, scholars, right? So that's, but I'm dying to get out there too, right? I'm dying to get back to work and things. So I'm hoping that as we move forward, we can kind of uh, come up with fun and, and unique ways to, to still get out there and perform, which is actually something I've kind of been working on on the side, which is, uh, you know, it has some potential, hopefully. So. Do you uh, want to talk about that now that you've baited us? No, like, <laughs> would that lead? No, you know what? Um, I had mentioned that I've been hosting the movies in the park here in town for several years. I have a giant inflatable movie screen and you can see it from, you know, a half a mile away. Uh, we also do crazy Christmas light displays at our house. So we're one of those houses that you pull up and you turn your radio and the lights go to the music. You know, that's us. Um, so I have an FM transmitter and I've been wanting to do a drive-in movie for our high school seniors here this year because, let's face it, it, it sucks to be a senior this year. And while it's a uh, small uh you know, thing to do, at least it's something for them, you know, to have a night to come out. And um, I was talking to a couple of local comics that would hopefully get to come out and maybe warm up the crowd before the movie. And, you know, everybody would be in their cars and they could stand up in front of the screen and we could pipe it in through the FM transmitter. So things like that, that are just kind of unique and, and out of the box, maybe combining events, um, to, to create some opportunity to do, do some live comedy. Um, we haven't been able to do it yet. Alameda County's uh, has not let up on the drive-ins the way Contra Costa and Santa Clara have yet. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, I have the uh, benefit of kind of having the inside track with the Board of Health though. So I'm, you know, continuing to work with them. And as soon as uh, something can open up, we, we will be doing that and hopefully, you know, it'll be different, right? It'll be telling jokes to cars and they'll be honking and flashing lights instead of laughing. I, I don't know, you know, in, in my mind, that's how it's going to go. So, but and, so and, and uh, as you were talking, I was thinking about some of the Easter services that I saw on the news where they had like a drive-in church mm -hmm. and they did it like that, yeah. that maybe looking at the models that churches have done because that's more of a universal thing than stand-up comedy so we could see what that what's been done in korea um because that's where i saw that it's a drive-in church so looking at those kinds of things might be one step that can start to engage this or re-engage com comedy again did we just come up with the first drive-in comedy club idea did I think so. Oh, we did. heard it here first. <laughs> well, that would be fun, you know, and I think that a lot of people would actually be interested in that. We'd probably get a better turnout than uh, a, a lot of regular shows, right? Just because people are dying to get out and, and do something and feel a connection with folks right now, either with people and or with their communities. You know, it would be, yeah. It would be nice. And, and comics are so, like, inconsiderate sometimes. I could see them also parking in the front because they're like, oh, I got here early. Parking in the front and messing the whole thing up just like they take up to tables in the front. That should be for patrons. So I can already see where it's going to go wrong.